Hello everyone, welcome to, to this tutorial. Uh, it's going to be how to make a YouTube background. I know I did one, but I made this one better. better. Anyway, I'll have this whole entire tem uh, folder available for you to download somewhere. Now there is Photoshop Portable 5, which I'm going to need to fix that, or CS5. Because for some reason it doesn't work. I'll fix that soon. Uh, CS4, CS4 one works better. Anyway, open your Photoshop. Yes, it does take a while to load up, but hey, I mean, it's Photoshop for God's sake. Oh, come on. Alright, go to File, Open. Uh, you Go to the YouTube Templates and Photoshop SD. Choose one of these. And you can see the little preview down here. I'm going to be using YouTube Channel Template for number 4, Open. And right off the back, I'm going to sit here, double click it, and give it an outer glow. I'm gonna make it more of a purplish, cause I like the color purple. Purple goes flat purple. Uh, I'm gonna make it spread 13, size 19, and then click OK. Now the backgrounds go over here and color overlay, and there you go. Now one of the cool, interesting ones that I'm thinking, or one of the best things that you want to start off with, is grabbing the paintbrush tool, getting to probably a 400 size, normal. Go over here and get a really, really dark purple. And sort of do the background layer only. And sort of paint. Oh, wait. Hey. Maybe paint now? Yeah, I can paint now. But yeah, just paint like little stripes and stuff. So it looks like something like that. Now go to the smudge tool. Right? And start smudging it. Now, yes, it will take a little while to load. But that's just normal for the smudge tool. You know, it, it does some pretty cool effects. Uh, so just keep, you know, keep doing this, and eventually you get something that looks like this. Now that looks pretty awesome. I'm gonna have to say it does look pretty awesome. File open. Now you want to go back to the YouTube template or YouTube background tutorial and I have some things included I got like a little green background sand slash bell sprout Gengar got this little orange thing and a purple spiral I'm gonna go ahead and open the Gengar and the purple spiral just so you show y'all now you see this has nothing wrong with it, so select all copy I'm gonna paste it make sure you have the uh, show tr transformation controls because you will use them. Now let's make this a bit smaller because there's no way in heck that I'm going to have something that huge taking up the side. And now we're going to go to the Gengar. Now so notice a little print down here. I'm just going to go to my polygonal uh, select uh, lasso tool. Simply try to select that, edit, clear. Now I'm going to select all, copy, go back here, control V, and shit, man. I totally forgot about that. But, um, just sort of center this, right? Actually, no, we're going to go ahead and just... <clears throat> move this back here. Hide the Gengar layer. I'll have to do this. Apply. Yeah, that should be good. Now click the Gengar layer. Sort of shrink it where it's above the purple, but you still see it behind. Now apply. Okay. And yes. That's pretty much a simplistic background. Now you can go over here to the Gengar layer. Add a outer glow. Bevel and gloss. With outer glow, let's do some pink. Maybe? No. Definitely purple. Dark. No, light. The lighter the color on the glow, the better. And 13, 19. That just works best for me. Okay. Now we're gonna go to the zoom tool and fit screen. No, actual pixels. So yeah, that looks pretty. Actually, pretty badass. Um. Yeah, that's pretty much how I make a YouTube uh, channel background thing. Um. I will have a website in the link. It's called Planet Renders dot com dot net my bad and you definitely want to uh register here 
because basically you can find any sort of video game character, any kind of abstract, like fractal, fractal, how do you pronounce that word, renders, PC renders, video game renders, see that we got Super Mario Galaxy 2 out, and uh, watch, I'm just going to see here, purple, and look at all the things that come up, now let's search Pikachu, and whoa, the Pikachu is a lot more. So they have all these awesome things, and the cool thing about this is, as soon as you register, let's choose this one. Just come over here, click on this. Well, I have the pop-ups enabled, but it looks like this. And this gray area, it is not a background. So basically, all you have is a little Pikachu image. This website will be in the link, and I do encourage you, along with my website, which will host the uh, background. This thing, which will host, of course, I gotta delete this one and re-edit the uh, Photoshop. But yes, yes, th that's pretty much all I really want to talk to you about. Uh, quick tutorial because I love doing tutorials and I need one up on my channel. Yeah, that's pretty much good channel. Now, I hope you guys enjoy it. Please make it on your own. Um, I know I didn't go through a bunch, but it's probably a basic one. I'll probably do a more advanced one way later on, or maybe tomorrow when I feel like it. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Comment on this, how you like it, and possibly comment on what my next tutorial should be. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.